don't know now you know I have these little cylinders in my room and I don't know and I just put random stuff in here and I wanted them to like look cute on my desk so I bought some stuff to put in it and it's gonna look real cute I had a vision honey so I got these rocks from Walmart um well this is a Walmart haul but I got these rocks that I'm gonna fill this with and I got like five of these bags um, and they were only 98 cents so that was pretty cute and then I got these little it comes in a pack of two okay, it's kind of sneaky so it comes in a pack of two and it's gonna look real cute with the rocks and it's just gonna be like one in there kind of like this just sticking up and it's gonna stick up like in the middle and it's gonna be on either side and I just thought that was really cute really very very simple and very very cute you know i'm trying to make it look like something in here when i walk in because I, I can't stand that clutter and you're gonna see um that i bought something to kind of minimize it but the next thing that i got was some picks for my hair because i need them for when i do my twist outs my braid outs or whatever and i can pick up my roots and i didn't have one of those and I also, um, I always when I go, I get a new candle because um, my other one is pretty much gone. So I got this scent called Pineapple Lily. I don't know if you guys can see that. And I thought it smelled like pretty good. So I got it. And so if you don't know, um, I live in my room my bathroom was like the guest room as well i mean the guest bathroom as well it's just a full bathroom so um i keep my toothbrush in my room and i wanted to just have a cover but just because i go over juan's house i go over people's houses and i don't want my toothbrush to be because my toothbrush has to charge I have one of those charging toothbrushes so um i just wanted to have like a little cover and i was looking for these i was like i need one of these covers because i hate when my toothbrush is just out like that so I did buy one of these um I have one of the electronic toothbrushes obviously so um it's kind of hard to find like the regular one because I had a regular one that just snapped but it doesn't go over it just because um it's too big my toothbrush is too big so I like these little clips because it's pretty much you know you could be versatile with them so I'm excited to use this I really hope it fits it says clips on most regular and electronics toothbrushes so hopefully it fits I didn't get these from Walmart, but I thought I'll show y'all these. My mom bought me these from Amazon just now. They just came in the mail. And they're just a one-a-day multi multivitamin. Um, just because I've been a little tired lately and just not, you know, because I get up really early. Um, and another thing that I got, I hope this, yeah, it should fit, was a, I got two of these black candles. These were only like $3.00. Because underneath my work stuff, y'all, I need undershirts under my work shirts because they're so thin. Y'all know how work shirts are. Shirts are. They're very thin, and I just hate hate when it like that. So I bought these, and I have a wax melt in my classroom. Once you guys see my classroom, um, which should be coming up this week, so you'll probably get it before this vlog. But as you saw, and so I'll go ahead and say, as you saw in my classroom tour that I had a wax melt, I brought a wax melt from home, so I need some more wax to put in it. So yeah, this is what I bought. These are only 93 cents. Um, then I got some Nair because I do wax. If this is TMI, you guys can skip about 10 seconds. I do wax, um, but I haven't found a wax in here. And so I haven't waxed since I've been in Space Pro yet. So I'm like, I need something so i just got went back to my holy grail nair sensitive skin formula and this works for me um i hope it doesn't you know i know they say you're not supposed to go back but i gotta do what i gotta do and the last thing that i got was this multi-purpose board cart and it looks like this y'all i needed this because my towels 
Um, I'm not sure if I showed you guys, but my towels are just in a bin because I don't I don't have anywhere to put them because there's not a linen closet in that bathroom. So my towels have just been in a hamper. And I'm just like, I need somewhere to put this. Um, I need somewhere to put my towels so I can easily access them. So I decided to buy this and I, I'm so happy I found this. This is only $15 at Walmart. It's really small and um, I think it's gonna be perfect for towels. Um, it looks, it says you're supposed to put it like in my room and um, that, but um, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in my room and I'm gonna set it up right here and I'll show you guys the after um, what it looks like. But I think it's gonna fit perfectly right here. I thought I was gonna have to move a lot of stuff for it to fit, but I pretty sure it's gonna fit pretty perfectly right here because it's not that big. So yeah, but I think that's all that I got from. Um, I think that's all that I got from Walmart. Oh, and my um lady product. Yeah, so I'm about to put everything together, and I'll show y'all the ending results. morning everyone and i don't know if i started the vlog oh i think i just started the vlog well if i didn't did i no i don't think i started the vlog i think i started like a couple of clips um dang every time i get on here i start hiccuping and stuff like, i hate that but i don't think i started the vlog you guys um so hello if you are new welcome to my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button and if you are not new hey girl what's up um so today i am clearly at work it is 8 20 class starts in about 10 minutes um i'm probably gonna do my room tour today i'm gonna try to do it today or tomorrow um what else my hair came out great i'm doing a video on this look well it didn't come out great but it came out you know like, I don't like the products that I use, but I'm tr I'm trying out new products and doing reviews on them. Um, but, I mean, I like it. I think it's real cute. You know, I wish it was more defined, though. Um, but, you know, that's a work in progress. Um, what else? I don't really have any updates right now. Oh, every time I come to my classroom... Something is either off the wall, off the floor. So I'm like, I need some stronger tape. And I keep telling them that. But yeah, I need some stronger tape because this is not working. I mean, today, like, everything was down. Like, these books were on the floor. The lights were down. And it was just like, oh, the post, this poster right here was down. I was like, somebody coming in here and doing this? Because I'm just kidding. Oh, you probably wondered about my attire. Oh, I spilled coffee this morning. Don't worry about that. But I'm wearing my Georgia Southern because today we're still doing the um, Black History Month and every day we do something different. So today, um, this is up your college or your HBCU. Obviously, I didn't go to HBCU, so I'm up at my college. I miss college. <gasps> I do. Yeah, I'm about to update my calendar here. Um, I don't really have anything to do today. Uh, oh, no. oh, it says start science. Okay, so we start science today. I'm a doodle. I'm a doodler. Doodle, 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 doodle. Okay, I'm just rambling. So I'm gonna talk back with y'all when I am actually doing something exciting. Let's call for buses 301 9611 four one and five last call like girl you don't need to yell on the intercom it's already the intercom you don't have to yell she'd be like last call but but like god dang relax that don't be irritating me because like the speaker's like right here but like she's yelling into the speaker and i'm like it's already loud. You don't have to yell. Just talk into it. You don't have to yell. Mm. <laughs> 
Good morning, everyone. If you hear that in the background, that is my um, heat. It is defrosting my window right now, but good morning. Happy Tuesday. Um, it's pretty cold out here. Ooh, like, I'm really cold. I came out here to say, tell y'all something. Um, that last clip probably that y'all saw was, uh, so me and hubby went to, uh, out to eat. And this crazy lady, well, she weren't crazy, but she was turning up up in there, honey. And I was like, I gotta get this on video. I tried my best, but it was pretty funny. Like, one of the workers was like, I don't need this job. I missed that part, I think, but it was hilarious. She was like, I don't need this job. I don't need this job. I was like, oh my God. <laughs> Hope your manager, your manager said that like, okay, I'm gonna need you to clock out. <laughs> Boy, but I am tired. This morning I had to make me some espresso and put it in my coffee because I am tired. I don't know why. I went to bed pretty early. Um, no, I didn't. Let me stop lying. Well, it was a little earlier than what I usually do. So, I guess you could say I went to bed early, but I did go though. But I didn't put on no makeup today. I just didn't feel like it. I was like, nope, not today. Because I'm tired. Today was supposed to be 70s wear. My sweater that I was going to wear, <laughs> or cardigan, was upstairs. And I decided, I was like, never mind. I ain't dressing up. <laughs> what 70s wear got to do with Black History Month? Like, they had all the wears, like 40s. Happy Thursday, everyone. So today, I just wanted to show you guys. I did watch the news this morning. And so they shut down, basically, I-20 Eastbound because they're investigating a shooting. So they had to shut down the whole highway. Um, starting at, I can't remember where it started at. Um, somewhere around here. Like, it's like a couple of exits up. So I'm so happy that I watched the news this morning. And you know, I'm taking the alternate rounds. Yes. And I quickly, y'all, cause I was watching news and I heard I-20 East. I said, oh, let me go. Let me go. Because baby, we're not doing this. We're not doing this today. But you see how the time is kind of inching up, but I think it's cause I'm just at this red light. But it's not it's, it's not worse than what it was the last time. So, but yeah. Um you know, a lot of people don't watch the news. So these people that still on the highway, baby, they, they better get stuck. They don't even know it. It's important to watch the news, y'all. Morning, 11 Alive News. They do live traffic reports, weather, news, and they just, it's literally like a circle. Like every minute, they're like updating, updating, updating. And then I followed the crash. Um, His name is Crash Clark. If y'all know from 11 and I Alive News, um, I watch him too. I mean, I follow him on Twitter too. So um, I'm in traffic like, okay, you know, what's the updates? It's still shut down. Okay, cool. Let me go this way. So, um, yeah, so part of adulthood, y'all. Y'all got to watch the news. Y'all can't be listening to rap music in the morning or whatever you're doing in the morning. If you're, I guess if you're commuting, if you're commuting like me, then you got to watch the news because you, you got to keep updated on them traffic reports but uh because they're this very important y'all y'all will be an hour delay keep on playing with them okay you will be hours delayed might as well turn around and go back home by the time you get to work so yeah but i will tap back with y'all when i'm at work i'm just gonna keep on going this way because y'all i'm trying to figure out where i'm at so bye i made it to work couple hours ago um i'm sitting in this in my zoom waiting for students to come um what else i brought lunch from my dinner yesterday but 
it's like only two like it's not a lot of stuff so i might end up ordering me something thinking about door dashing look how i feel like this thing is cricket honey what's going on but yeah oh, y'all my neck hurts so bad i don't even know why it just does um but right now i'm just waiting on people to come to my zoom let me show y'all my new little setup So if you guys want a backstory, so she always comes in my room and tells me that she loves the scent that I have. And I thought it was in a candle, but it wasn't. I just got it from Walmart. And so I was like, oh, I want her to have this scent because she just loves it so much. And she even went to Walmart to look for it. And she could not find it. So I just felt so bad. I was like, I got to get her this. And it wasn't even expensive. It was like $7 wax melt. Like, but no one thinks to get that. So I just got it for her, you know. And I wanted to get her reaction. So I'm happy I got that. <laughs> Friday. I did another twist out. This one actually came out better than the last one, but I still don't have that definition that I want. But um, I just want to come on here real, real quick um, to say happy Friday. And um, I did get, I was able to print out my book for the gaze. I'm going to be taking the gaze probably in April. I'm going to try to get in there in April if I think like. It's no, I think I'm ready. I'm going to be ready. You know, I have a whole month basically to study for it. And, you know, I feel like April is going to be really a good month for me. And I really, 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 really want to pass it. So I'm going to try to do my best. Um, because if I pass this, then I can get me a job as a, like, as a permanent teacher. And then I have three years to get a degree in or master's in education so i mean once i start like studying for this i'm probably gonna start applying to schools you know master's programs probably gonna be georgia southern because you know you guys know i went there <laughs> um but yeah i can't believe like, i keep saying to myself like i can't believe i have to go back to school and like i was not planning on, like at first i was planning to go back to school so i'm gonna go back to school for computer science that's why i say it but then I got a squat set. I am never going back. And look at me now. The Lord said you are. So, yeah. So, studying for the gays. I did. Let me get back into the school realm because I'm about to be in there. Ugh, I hate when that happens. I'm about to be. I'm about to be in this school. This you know the school thought process all over again hopefully i'm more mature i feel like i'm more mature now though definitely more mature um i just gotta figure out how to pay for school but i think if you get employed they pay for it for you that's what i'm hearing so that's what i'm like okay and i think i got some financial aid left a school expensive honey so you know and it definitely helps when you have a job you know and if I get my master's in education, I get paid more. 
it's a win-win to be honest so yes i just have to pass this case i'm really nervous about it but one of the teachers had told me like it's not that bad like it's not that hard so i was like i hope you're right <laughs> so yeah even if i don't pass it i'm gonna take it again like i'm not gonna just be like oh, i didn't pass it you know cry 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 look Today, usually on Fridays, the kids have a test. So, I'm just sitting in my Zoom waiting on people. But it's 9.30 now, and I used to get off my Zoom around this time. So, I don't know if the teacher wants me to go to her Zoom today. She'll probably be like, we're taking a test or something like that. So, I'm going to try anyways, because, baby, that's what I've been told to do. That's what they don't really, I just feel like. The teachers don't usually realize that I'm just doing what, what I've been told to do. That's all that is. That's it. I'm just like, I'd be like, I'm just doing what I was told to do. They told me to come into your Zoom and watch, watch what she say. I'm about to show y'all, watch what she say. Ms. Robinson, we're, we're doing a test right now. I was in the other teacher's Zoom and she didn't even let me in. I was like, or you could just tell me like, hey, we have a test today. So they're not going to be coming to you for this subject. You know, you could just say that. Just communicate. But they, they don't communicate. Like, at all. Like, I know that other grade levels aren't like this. Like, like I said, like, there's like two teachers that definitely communicate with me. No, three three that communicate with me but the other two y'all they do not communicate at all and it's like pulling teeth i'm just like and they be the main ones sending extra students the main ones sending extra students see i'm sitting here and she not even let me in but like i said just communicate that with me that we're not doing a lesson today for writing just say that. Don't just have me sit here wondering, like, oh, what do I do? What do I do? Child, I've been being productive though. Like, I'm, I got my emails out to them. I sent them and watched them still not do it. So, the teacher is supposed to add me to their Google Classroom, add me to their uh, Class Dojo account, and also give me the, um, uh, I think there's a way I can go in there and check, but if I don't have access to your Google Classroom, I can't go in there and check if they're missing work or not. That's some like add me to your Google Classroom. Like, so they're supposed to do all those things. So I sent a message out, an uh, email out, because my supervisor is telling us to do that. Like, he's like, you need to make sure you're making sure that the students are taking care of their missing assignments and everything like that. I can't do that if they won't do their part. So that's so why I said, I, I, and I CC my supervisor in it just so he knows that I am reaching out and asking them you know now as far as missing work that's probably my fault you know i should have been you know keeping up with that and stuff like that but i would definitely make sure i'm doing that i probably actually will take my computer home this weekend and just try to go over um just try to get organized and write down what on my list the only the students on my list like i said that's all i'm concerned about um write down what they're missing so that way we can work on it i'm not sure when we can work on it um but I'll find some time to work on it. Maybe during general's time, I'm going to ask, can I keep them? Just so we can start working on that missing work. Um, let me think. What else? Oh, and today I was going to try to eat lunch with my students. Um, so, if I get them, if they come. If not, then we'll just try Monday. But he did say, like, oh, try to eat lunch with them. And you can, like, put on a movie for them or something like that. Which I'm probably going to do. And yeah so yeah i'm really excited like i feel like things are gonna start moving very quickly time waits for nobody it's already the end of february about to be march and i'm like um it's time to start like getting things done like i can't just sit here and dwell and wait for things to come to me because it's not gonna happen